What's up, guys? We're gonna go over here where we've been dredging at in the last couple videos. Uh, I think the only thing I'm gonna take is my backpack and my little shop back and a pan and do some crevicing. See what we come up with. Dragging this morning is 11:30. I was wanting to be gone two hours ago, two and a half hours ago. It didn't happen. But anyway, we'll see you down here. All right, then. All right, guys, we got our first crevice here. I muddied the water up down here. But I'm gonna scrape around in there. And see how this shop back does. First time trying it. I was gonna use it the other week, but it didn't work out that way, so anywho. Alright, let me do some more cleaning up clean some of these rocks and leaves out of the way um, I don't have a classifier I'm not going to use a classifier and uh, see what we get I'll bring you back in just a minute alright guys all this little dirt right in here I'm going to hit <laughs> Good to go. Get that big rock in there. I'll bring y'all back in just a minute. All right, guys. I've got this crevice here cleaned out pretty good. I'm working on this one right here now. That's the material I dug out with my hands. There's still material in my shop back. The shop back's working good. The only thing about it is the capacity and as much water as I have here it don't want to uh, it fills up with water too quick is what I'm trying to say and um, that's the only issue I'm having with it I'm having to dump water pretty quick but other than that we're still working on this one area right here I'm going to have to go back to the car and get my glasses because I forgot them but uh, that's where we at, guys. What I'm doing, I'm uh, taking my hands and digging, scooping out the big 
you know, the majority of stuff and uh, getting it down to where there's hardly anything in there and what's left I suck up with the shop back and uh, that's that's what I'm doing like I said it's working good it's just my capacity is it's sucking up more water than it is material which is getting the material good it just is filling up with water too quick I may have to try to configure a different design instead of that bottom that come with it but uh we'll be back in a minute all right guys i got everything cleaned out of them crevices over there cracks crevices whatever you want to call them excuse me i'm wiping sweat off my face i saved y'all the agony of me having to pan this down and this is where i've got it to See if I can get a. Well, it'd be nice if the sun would shine through right there. But uh, see if there was anything in them. I have not looked. I know the next one we work probably won't have anything in it because I've cleaned it out already. But. I hadn't put the shop back on it. Boy, they sure is a lot of black sand in that. Get that big old rock out of the way there. Something that we haven't found a lot of around here is uh, black sand. It's been very, very little. Here's a small speck. It's too small for the camera to pick up, I'm sure. There's some more. That ain't bad sign, some lead. some kind of metal nail or something. I don't know if y'all see that or not. Anywho. Shots down. Guys, I don't know if y'all can see it. I know this camera's hard to pick up. Right up there in the corner, I hope I got it where y'all can see some super fine gold. Right there. It's fine. Real fine. That one looked like it's, it's got uh, iron stone on it or something. Well, let's do a fine tune on it and see if there's anything missed. I know that's annoying. It's annoying me. Let's 
see if there's any more that I missed. Speck right there. I better get it before I lose it. No, a lot of people use them Garrett Super Sluice pans. There's another piece of gold right there. Um, damn, there's two. One there, one there. This right here is why I don't use them. Because when you're in fine gold, um, there's another piece. You have no way of fine tuning it and and cutting out a lot of material. See, right there's another piece. Right there. See, if I had one of them Garrett Super Sluices, I'd have throwed that out. Granted, it ain't that big, but what have I found? Three, three, four pieces now. There's another tea tiny piece way up there in the corner. Ow! That gum, they something around here that's eating me alive. See right there in the corner? Right, right there. But they've just got too deep of ripples in them. And then you don't have your fine. See, I've got this that I do my first with. Then I go through like you seen. And then I break it down to even finer for the finer gold. But uh, that's the reason I don't use a Garrett Super Sluice because I am not in an area to find big gold. If that's what you was looking for, you know, it'd be different. But I'm, I'm looking for it, but it ain't out here. So uh, anyway, we're gonna uh, move up to that next one and uh, get it cleaned out. And I'll bring y'all back when we do. Be back in a minute. All right, guys. I got that crevice sucked out, and it got muddy real quick. Like, let's see if I right. See if there's no gold in there. Kinda got a feeling it's just gonna be mainly silt from where we dredge up around the corner there. No, there's some black sands in it. That's a good sign. Some lead. There's a little bit of gold in there.
couple of days more in there than I thought. I wasn't expecting any. Like I said, it's fine. I hope y'all will be able to see it when I get it worked up here. Working the trash up with it. Had a piece to float away. Alright. Can y'all see that up there? This is all straight from the shop back. I didn't scoop no material out. Look, there's a piece of gold right there. Um lost it. It's floating. Right there it is. Uh, this is all. I sucked that crack out with the shot back and my darn gold's floating. Go ahead and fine tune it right quick. Speck, two specks, three specks. pieces up there. I know I put the carb uh, whatever that thing's called back on there and it's annoying. Carabine. There it is. After going back through it again with the fine tuner, that's the uh, reason I use these pans that I use. Darn gold quit floating on me. Alright guys, let me wash my pan out of here. Got off my hat. Alright, that's going to do it today. I was just wanting to try out that shop back, being I haven't tried it yet. I've been, uh, let me get y'all over here while I ain't throwing you around everywhere. Um, I've been carrying it around with me for since I got it, since that couple videos ago. Oh, hold on just a minute. Sorry about that. Um, 
and uh, I just wanted to test it out and see how it worked. And uh, it works good. It just it's probably going to be more for smaller pockets that a whole lot of water don't run into because um, it fills up with water real quick. Um, but that's a that's a awesome little design that uh, Dewalt come up with there. Straight battery, no cord, no nothing, just 20 volt battery, and. Uh, I like it, especially for what I'm using it for. Um, so I give d a thumbs up on that one. But uh, anyways, I'm out of here. Ask you guys to remember to like, please share, comment if you'd like. I would like for you to. And, uh, like share comment and uh, I guess until next time we'll see you on the next video please do share this uh, I need to get more viewers and more subscribers so I'd appreciate if y'all share it and hopefully you friends like my content and if there's anything else y'all want to see just uh, drop me a line and let me know and we'll we'll go from there Alright guys, until the next video, y'all have a good rest of the week, or a good week coming up, and uh, we'll talk to you then. Alright, bye.